Hi, my name is Dave Andrews. Today I'm going to show you how to remove items from the Start menu. Let's go to our computer and we're going to click on the Start menu, uh, which is down here at the bottom. And as you can see, I have a lot of items here uh, that are in the Start menu. And this is actually uh, where Windows is remembering the programs that I have run recently. Uh, to remove one of these from this list, let's just right click on it and click, and click on Remove from this list. As you can see, that icon has uh, been removed and it's been replaced with another program that I just used recently. I can also remove that one. And I can remove ones from up here at the top. Now, this is the list of recently used programs. Uh, there's also, if you click on all programs, um, usually a much longer list, uh, which includes folders and, and things like this. And up here are some programs. If there's a program here that I know I'm never going to use, uh, I'm just going to pick one at random here, let's say Windows Calendar. And I don't want that to show up in my Start menu. I'm just going to right click on it as well, and then I'm going to click on Delete. Now that's not actually deleting the Windows Calendar program. What it's doing is it's deleting a shortcut uh, to that Windows Calendar uh, program. So the program's still installed, it's just being removed out of the Start menu. So uh, since that is actually a, uh, a Windows protected file, you have to be an administrator to click on Continue. And not all of those programs are going to be like that. It's just the one that I picked uh, happened to uh, require administrative access to remove from the list. My name is Dave Andrews, and I've just showed you how to remove icons from the Start menu.